guys, this is Lexi with the Rock and Roll Tennis Camps and today we have a question from Sebastian from La Cañada, California who's asking how to be relaxed on the forehand. Well Sebastian, I'm sure you're not the only one who's wondering how to do that. Uh, so I'll, I'll give it my best shot. So in order for me to answer that question first, we gotta establish uh, that forehand is nothing else than a, a string of sections pieced together into one smooth swing. So with that understanding in mind, there are little tricks that you have to do in each of the sections throughout the swing. So starting with the, with the ready position for the forehand. So here's, here's your relaxation. Your right arm is not doing anything. It's barely on the racket like we discussed in the, in the other video about unit turn. Uh, speaking of unit turn, that's the next part. You, you get in the racket too into unit turn it's still it's still in your rest position so you still haven't start working that that arm at all so you take it all the way to the side so from that point you gotta separate in, into a take back and so in, right here in the, in the take back your racket should be straight up so that it, again it basically takes you no effort to hold it look I, I can release almost all my fingers and it still stays rather than holding it like this where the gravity starts pulling it down so wrist stays up here so that's the beginning so it's still barely working at all I'm already at the, at the take back so after that I'll let, I'll let the gravity take take some control and drop the racket into the swing into the every everybody's favorite leg that just evidence that your wrist is relaxed and, and you let the, the racket the leg all the way back into the contact point and this is where you're gonna be actually doing some work so this is where you're gonna squeeze it hard so that your racket doesn't give way to the ball. So this is where you, you, you hold it tight all the way through the contact point, all the way through the release. Now ball is gone, you're going back to re relax and you let the arm go. So a lot of people st stop their arm physically. You shouldn't do it. Just let, as, as, soon, as soon as the ball leaves the strings, you're done working, ball is gone, just re relax your arm. So basically, if you, if you really do it correctly, you will relax 90% of the swing. So be relaxed, 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 tight at contact point so that the right, you, you don't lose the contro uh, control over the angle of your strings. Tight through the middle. As soon as the ball leaves, you're going back to rest. So that's, that's, the, that's your answer, Sebastian. So you, you have to master, tighten up just when you need to right in the middle of the swing and keep all the rest of the parts uh, of the swing relaxed. Hope this helps guys. Uh, until next time, go rock the courts.